Guys, it's kind of hard to save money. Especially when you're broke. Hey guys, welcome back to Weekday One Up. How are you? You're good, I know. I so, know. before we talk about today's episode, what's going on tomorrow? Right well, now, right now, we're at Anime Midwest. We're doing something. You might, you might watch this episode and like sitting there waiting in line for something, and you might see us walk by and you'll be like, "There they are!" I bet I can tell you what we're doing right now. I bet I'm like running around trying to record cosplay people. Maybe we're walking around the dealer's room. Something. Find us, guys. We aren't that hard to find. We People look like tell this. us all the time, I was at the con the whole weekend, I didn't see you at all. And I'm like, where were you? Well, if it was like a place like Momo. <laughs> Dang, I saw the mist on that one. Holy crap. How? Like, it came out through your hands, man. I saw a mist. That was crazy. Like, that was cool. <laughs> I've barely even felt anything come out. It was a weak sneeze. I mean, it was, I saw it. All right. Well, anyway, train. You gotta scream for trains. Trailing. Um. Hang on, sorry. Everything itches. Ah. Okay. Tomorrow night we've got a Kigurumi party, 9 p.m. Uh, on the bottom floor, the basement level of the height. To the left. 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 Everything you own in a box. To the left. We're gonna be playing Cards Against Humanity and maybe doing a weekday one up there. Perhaps. And just hanging out with with uh, the fans and getting pictures. It's a great picture. Maybe we'll bring a speaker, having some music going. Maybe I don't know. Um, we we probably won't bring food because we're broke. We mm. wanted to bring. Food, there will be no food. Don't expect that. <laughs> there will be no food. Uh, so if you want, if you want, own. if you want to supply it with like a little Caesar's pizza, be, I don't mean, bring it on up. Uh, anyway, just kidding. Are, don't waste your money on. We are this. also having a panel. Panel on Sunday at so, 10 a.m. This Sunday, this coming Sunday. Yeah, it's uh, called Conven Meet the Convention Reviews Crew. Mm -hmm. So come and hang out with us and ask us questions in person. We don't know where it's at. Uh, it's in a panel room. It's in our panel room. That narrows it down. We're going to figure it out when we get there. You guys can figure it out if you just look at your guidebook. Yeah. But, yeah, without further ado, we're going to talk about how did we even get to this con? How did we save money to get here? Not easily. Well, it wasn't that bad. I'm terrible at saving money. You know this. This We can go off two different perspectives here because we can go off being terrible at it and being pretty decent at it. Mm -hmm. Um, You want to go first? Me or what? what, what? We'll see. Why don't you tell your experience with saving money for con? There is no experience with saving money. I just never have money. I somehow scrimp by and am able to pay for the hotel and ticket. Is that what you recommend? Scrimp by? No. <laughs> but I can't talk now because I've actually saved a little bit of money for this con this time. Well, good job. The, the last time I had a ton of money for a con, I think was Con Alt Delete. Really? I think. But I know the one time I did have a lot of money for it was... Like the first time, I, the first time I was like, "Oh my gosh, I have money that I can just blow at this con." Was at YumaCon, oh, because that was when we were getting like hella good hours at work. Yeah, and I just had like four hundred something in the bank, and I was just like, "I got money for days," and now I have. See, now there is the difference right there between me and Dakota. He just literally said it. I had four hundred something in the bank. I have money for days. If I had four hundred in the bank, I would be like, I can't spend a penny. Because that's not good. Not good at all. You're, you're just better at saying... It's because you're more strict. You're, I, like to, I like to say you disagree, but you really are. You're a penny pincher. I'm not a penny pincher. I spend money on crap all the time. Mm. But you spend money on crap that you want, and but then I'll be like, hey, let's, uh, let's go see a movie. Ah, that's too expensive. Mm. I think I'm just better at saving it. I'm better at... Being like, is this what I want? Like, do I need this really right now, or is it not gonna matter? And um, did you need the snapbacks that you just bought? Yes. 
Well, actually, I only bought them because they were on sale. They were like seven dollars each. Oh, really? Yeah. So, like, I wouldn't have bought them if they were full price. Um, okay, that's not so bad then. I don't know. I, I'm somehow just I convince myself. I have like a trick that I play on myself where I tell myself that I have no money. So, like, I'll go somewhere, and I'll be like, I really want to buy this game, but then I'll be like, uh, I only have six hundred dollars. And the way I trick myself is I'll be like, well, I've got this coming up and this coming up and this coming up. And how many hours am I getting? I'm not getting that much. How many checks? How much checks am I getting? It's not that much. So I'm just like, and then I, I ask myself, because I do this a lot too, where I'll buy a game and then not play it that much. I'll be like, do I have other things I want to play right now? What percentage of these games would you say you have beaten? 20. <laughs> yeah. And there's a lot over here. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Like, so I've look at how many PS4 games I have, though. So clearly, I have I have four. So clearly, I have changed my ways a little bit. But I, I just like I'll be thinking, do I have other games I can play right now that I have not beat that I like and I know I want to beat? If the answer is yes, which it normally is, I don't get the game. And if I really, really want a game, I probably have pre-ordered it and I'm at the midnight release. That's the difference. So, mm. I don't know. For me, it's... Um, I, I'm getting better at that. Like, I just found out today, like I told you, you know, I had more money in the bank because I was kind of doing something similar. Mm -hmm. But I'm not as strict as you are with it. Mm -hmm. Like, for me, I'm like... Uh, and you're really bad at it. Like, I didn't go to PopCon. Um, and you're like, come on, man. You can do it. Why can't you do it? And I was like, I need to save money for Midwest. Well, it was a super cheap con, though, so it didn't make sense. Yeah, but I'm glad I didn't go because it apparently was not good. But you could have met Troy Baker, which is kind of worth the money. I'm sure. It cost $10 to I'm get a picture. I'm sure I will meet him again someday. I'm sure he'll go. He's going to more cons recently. I'm sure he'll be there. Now, if Nolan North had been there, I'd have been like... I'd have been and they there. battled? Yeah. You could have also met Markiplier. Yeah. That was. Is it bad that that's what got me? It's because I'm... I've been following Markiplier longer than Troy Baker. No, that's not bad. Um, I also do this thing where I have a... I think I have a higher um, number in my head where I don't want to get below than what you do. Mm. So, like, my number in my head that I don't want to get below is, like, I don't want to be in the 100s for sure. So if I'm below 200, that, that, that's an issue. Mm -hmm. So I see that I'm about to go below 200, <coughs> which doesn't happen that often nowadays because I've been able to save really well but um if it does happen which it's typically will happen if i've had a bunch of cons back to back which is pretty much what i've been in right now and i'm still continuing in so i may get pretty broke here pretty soon but if i see that i'm about to go below 200 suddenly did the line just burn out what was that they just flickered oh suddenly i don't want to spend anything like i really don't like if i had plans on something i'll be like i can't do it I have to wait till the next check. I can't do it because I know I have things coming up and it's not good. I also normally for hotels, I put my uh, card down on the hotel when they normally take money out to hold it. So they'll take like, like I know at Midwest they're going to take 50 a night. That's another 150 that I need to make sure I have in my account because like you guys don't have to worry about it because your card's not on it. But that actually helps me save money. Because I'm like, I know I have to have that in there, so I can't spend it or we can't get the hotel, right. so I might as well just try and make sure I save that. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how to tell you guys. I think the best thing you can do is convince yourself to not spend money somehow. That's what I've been doing recently. Like I, like, like I said, I convinced myself this week that I was below 100. Look today, I'm above 100. That's the other thing. Other, another thing I do is I don't look at how much money I have until I get a paycheck. Um, because then I convince myself, like, I'll be like, I'll start thinking, how much did I spend? And then I start thinking I spent more than I actually did. And I'm like, no, I can't. I don't, probably don't have anything. And then I look after the paycheck and I'm like, oh, I was okay. That was good. But then you have another bit of advice that I thought you started doing, which was to leave your debit card and don't if, bring it. If you are trying to save money, I have a real bad, like, I'll have like, it's going off like three times. If you're an impulse buyer, like Dakota is. Oh, I'm such an impulse buyer. Um, I bought Yarlog on an, on an impulse. How much was this? It was five bucks. It's exactly. worth it, though. He's a member uh, of the family. Exactly, guys. He's a member of the family. Come on. You can see the difference right happening right before your eyes. He bought it. 
I wasn't gonna buy it. Okay, anyway, go on. But aren't you glad I did? You know, I what? I'm not gonna answer that question. Go on. Well, let's just throw him away then. I don't really think he's that big of a deal. Oh, come on. Do you guys like Yarlock? Is Cody a douchebag? I don't hate Yarlock, but I don't think he makes the show. He doesn't make the show, but he's a little bit Go on about there. saving money. Saving money. Um, I... Um, recently, I haven't done it a lot lately just because I've had more money recently that I've just been like, okay, I'm fine. But if I'm getting to the point where I'm like, I need to save money, I need to just not do anything, I literally take, like, I don't carry cash on me that often. Wait a minute, that's another difference. You said when I get to the point, I'm always at the point of I need to save money. I'm never out of that mindset. Anyway, um, I get to the point where I'm like, okay, save money, I got this thing coming up. I take my debit card out of my wallet, put it on my dresser at home, and just... And then I go somewhere and I'm like, okay, oh, look, I'm at GameStop. Well, okay, well, okay, I'm going to buy this thing. Oh, left my debit card at home. Darn. And then I'm ups- I'm mad at myself because I'm like, oh, you idiot, why would you do that? And then I get in the car and I'm like, thank God I did that. Literally five minutes later, you'll be like, oh, thank God mm-hmm. that I didn't buy that. It was smart to not buy it. Mm-hmm. And I think another good advice is to not carry cash around on you. Cash really does burn a hole in your pocket, guys. If you see it in there, I, I'm good at saving money, but I'm the same way with cash. If I see cash in there, I'm like, well, it's not coming out of my bank. Like, that, I don't see that number going down, so I'm like, eh, for I me can late, spend this. For me lately, like, I took money out. Like, I took money out of the bank um, because, like, I, for, to give you the money for the hotel. And my aunt had actually given me, and I took more out than what I thought I was going to do. But my aunt had actually paid me because I was helping her. So, in my mind, I was like, okay, here's cash. And I was like, I don't want this cash. So I went and put it back into the bank. That's good. That was good. I put, I think I put 20. Seriously, guys, if you want to save money, don't have cash. If you get cash, put it in the bank. It, whether you believe it or not, if you watch yourself, like watch your habits, I almost bet, everyone's different, but I would almost bet you spend more money when it's cash. Mm-hmm. So That's just a little bit of advice that we go by. Obviously, we're no expert, no. but this was suggested by somebody. I'll read who suggested it. So it was actually asked as a question, but I thought we could make a whole episode out of it. Yeah. Um, it was asked by Sir Cody Matoy. Matoy? Yeah. So there's your answer. That's how we save money for cons. I hope it helped. And with that, how do you guys save money for cons? What is, like, give us serious something, tips. Something you told me, I forgot we didn't mention, is you told me budget. Like, give yourself, yeah. like, a budget for, like... I pushed it up. I you told me thirty. I pushed it up and actually gave it a bit of a forty, mm. just just because I know how I am. He means what he means is forty a check. Forty a check to spend on yourself. And Obviously, you're allowed to spend other money if you have to for like a bill say, or something. But say you yeah like like that's what the budget is. You get like say you got to do like forty a month for insurance, eighty for rent or whatever. Like you take that money out, but then you left with forty dollars for yourself to spend. Like, say, if you get paid bi-weekly. And anything else you have... Yeah, that's for two weeks. $20 a week to spend on yourself. Yeah. And that's everything. That's, like, other than gas. Other than gas, yeah. Well, I mean, that's everything, like... Like, you want to go eat? Okay. If you want to eat out. If you want to go to B-dubs, okay, that's $10 right there. Okay, you're left with $30 for... And especially if you got paid that day. And personally, I think it should be lower than 40 but that was... I just gave myself 40 just because I know how I am. That's why you should give it 30 to force yourself into that. Mm-hmm. Um, in my mind, I was like, you're not being fair to yourself. And I'm like, yeah, mm-hmm. right. I didn't go, I'm not going above 40. I'm not going to go above 40 ever. I'm not going to be well, okay, I pushed to 50. Cause then we're getting into some, I think anytime you push it to begin with, you've already kind of given up. Well, you, I haven't given up. Okay. Well, I'm not going to say you have, cause you have saved money. Yeah. So, uh, but anyway, let us know real tips, guys, real tips. Cause these could actually help people out on how you save money. And if you guys are looking for tips to help save money for cons, check in the comments below. It is possible. Believe it or not, we somehow make it to the large majority of the cons we go to. Another tip, this kind of sucks, but become a con YouTuber or photographer, and then you'll get press passes and you can get in for free. So That's actually, you, that doesn't take care of the hotel or anything, but it takes care of the badge prize. So we're getting in this weekend. like That this. helps a lot, but... Uh, obviously not everyone can do that, but if that is something you're already interested in doing, just know that to look into press passes, because that will help you when you need to go to a lot of cons. Mm-hmm. Uh, for one a year, I don't think it really matters, but if you're going to like one a month, that was really helpful. Yeah, so with all that said, it's time for the question 
of the day. Primal Yukina. Yuket Yukta. Yuktina. Primal. Primal Yuktina. What the? They asked, "What kind of computer mouse?" You just sent me something. I did. It just said Jimmy Dakota Richards came out. Was it a Snapchat? Oh, it just went through. Okay. Anyway, what kind of computer mouse do you use? <coughs> I use the mouse pad. You did. You use the little mouse thing. Yeah, cause I I don't do much on computers right now. Oh, I use just a like a wireless Logitech mouse. We don't use anything special. I think what they wanted to know is, is they probably like think that we're that like little scroller thing deal. They probably think we're like computer gamers and we're not. Yeah, we're not really part of the PC. Dude, right oh now. my god! Not to like hate on PC or anything, mm-hmm. but I was annoyed. We went in the game room at PopCon. Literally one little corner of consoles. The entire game room was PCs. The whole thing, and I was like, what? Like, really? Okay. Master Race is taking over, I guess. No, we're, we're just boring. We don't use any, like, yeah. cool mouse that you'd be interested in. A little in wireless $10 mouse? They did write under it what kind of mouse they use, and I was just like, I have no effing idea what you're talking about. So. No offense. Not to offend you, yeah, but that we're just, it's not our. Not not our cup of tea. Yeah, it's not our thing. Um, not our thing of thing. So. Dang, is that all we've gotten No, to? we accidentally stopped. Oh. Anyway, I don't know where we're at, so we should definitely wrap it up. Yep. So sorry about if it's a shorter episode. I don't uh, think it is. I think yeah. we're fine. What kind of mouse do you use? Yeah. What kind of mouse let do us... you use, guys? I won't know what you're talking about. Yeah. Let us know anyway. I'm sure somebody. Are you part, here? We go. Are you part of the PC Master Race? Or are you a console person? Oh God, no! Don't ask that. We don't want that in the comments. You're gonna start a war. <laughs> we're gonna have to disable the comments on another video. I said that, and as I said it, I was like, wait. Come back! Can I bring it back? No! I get back! Anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to follow us, you can do that right here. This is the Twitter, the Instagram, and the Snapchat for both of us. Um, and we do respond to fans. So. so, also, when you share this video, if you do, or any of our videos, talk about it on Twitter, all that stuff, hashtag WD1Up right there. Use it. And don't forget, we are at Anime Midwest right now. Don't forget about the Kiyu party. If you see us, feel free to come say hi. And when you say hi, be ready. We're probably going to tell you about the panel on the Kiyu party. Yeah, because we're, we're trying to advertise like crazy. Don't be afraid. We're we're, we're just dudes. We're not gonna be. We're not gonna be like <laughs> peasant. <laughs> you might be thinking, why are they saying don't be afraid? But we have. Especially me with my other channel with like seeing it happen more just because my channel is bigger and you've seen it happen to me like seeing people a lot of people come up shaking and extremely nervous and I think maybe you don't think you're going to be like that but when you see somebody that you've never met in real life but you know you feel like you know them and you watch them all the time on the internet suddenly I'm not saying starstruck at all but I'm saying you do get nervous. That's how I was when I saw Doug Walker that time. Mm -hmm. Like I like like you don't know what to say. You don't want to mess it, it was up. Just like, he walked by and it was like uh, big, big video you channel. Know. But just know that you you really can't mess it up. Like you're fine. We understand. Completely. I mean, if all you want to do is just come and say, "Hey guys, I watch you." And if you do want a picture, because I've had people tell me that they said hi and they wanted a picture and were too shy to ask, <laughs> just say it. We are perfectly happy to. I'm a camera whore. Yeah, like, we're perfectly happy to. Stop like one of my dreams is to be in every picture ever. Super unrealistic. <laughs> setting the setting your goals a little high. Like you know that first picture that was ever taken. I'm in it. <laughs> you better start learning Photoshop. <laughs> oh no, I don't need a Photoshop. I'm there. All right, guys, come find us this weekend and stay nerdy. Peace out. Don't forget to point it up. That's not, that's wrong thing. That's my thing. This is not your hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to watch yesterday's video, click right here in the center of the screen. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And read the description to find our other channels plus our Twitch and more. Nice, bro. Could you just keep that in? <laughs>